Hello everyone and welcome to another video tutorial. Today we are going to go through how to install Microsoft Clarity in any website using Google Tag Manager. So as usual, we're going to go straight to the point. So job number one, we're going to come here to clarity.microsoft.com. For those of you who don't know, Clarity is a great alternative to Google Analytics. And we're going to click on Get Started. Now, I already created an account and I logged in. So once we are ready to get started, we're going to create a new project. So let's say here that we want to track a website. I'm going to give here my website's name. And I'm going to copy the URL of my website here. And I'm going to paste it right here to add a new project. So once we add a new project, then Microsoft Clarity is going to take us to this page. And we are going to say we want to install the code manually. Like you can also go through the third party platform installation, but for this tutorial, we want to get the tracking code. So we are going to simply copy the tracking code. So this is a tracking code here. We're going to copy it, copy to clipboard. And at this point, we are going to go to Google Tag Manager. So when we come to Google Tag Manager, assuming that Google Tag Manager is installed on all the pages of our website, I have a video on that also if you have, uh, if you want to check my, my channel. So assuming that Google Tag Manager is installed in all the pages of the website, we are going to create a new tag. So either you are going to click on Tags and then New, or if you are an overview, you are going to say New Tag. We are going to call this tag Microsoft Clarity New. And here we have the usual job for those of you who are not familiar, tag configuration and triggering. So we're going to select tag configuration. And in this screen here, I'm going to select custom HTML. I'm going to paste the tracking code here. So the tracking code I copied from Microsoft Clarity I'm going to paste it in here, and then I'm going to go to triggering, and I'm going to say all pages. So all pages triggering is something that already exists in your Google Tag Manager. I'm going to add the trigger, and this is our configuration. So custom HTML, you paste the code, triggering is all pages. You save, and once you save, make sure to submit and publish your container because if you don't publish the changes are not going to go live now let's verify that it's working right so we are pretty sure we did a great job but it's always cool to verify if it is working so we are going to click on preview here and once we click on preview in our google tag manager the tag assistant is going to open up we are going to paste our url here and we're going to click connect so now what we're going to see is a window that opened up, which is my website connected to the Tag Assistant. And all we have to do is to go here to the Tag Assistant and under Tags Fired, we should have this one here, Microsoft Clarity New. That was the tag that we just created. So it is firing correctly. So just make sure that you double check just to verify if the implementation is correct. So now we verified that the implementation is correct. So that's it. That's everything you need to do. That's all the steps. So all you have to do is to create a project. This is your website. That's your URL. The system will give you the tracking code. And then from there, you're going to go to Tag Manager, create a new tag, custom HTML, paste the code, trigger is all pages. And from there, you can enjoy your new Microsoft Clarity report. OK, so once you install Microsoft Clarity, then the system will take some time. And eventually, what you see here that is called Dashboard will be available. So give it 24 hours. And then you can come here. You can have a look at Dashboard. And you will be able to see all the data in Microsoft Clarity. We are going to create another video tutorial on how Microsoft Clarity dashboard looks like in the future. So stay tuned. If you manage to install the tag, then make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, 
and have a great day in any time zone. Bye, everyone.